Gentleman on the screen now is Patrick King. He is the Truckers Freedom Convoy co-founder, and he joins me now. Are you staying to the end, sir? Uh, yeah, absolutely we are. Um, we've already discussed this long time ago that we will not back down. Are you going to fight back? I mean, could it come to violence? It looks pretty uh, dramatic right there, right now. It will never come down to violence. Those people have nothing to do with our trucks. They are there to f fight for their re their rights and freedoms, and that is allowed under our Constitution, and that's their God-given right to stand and protest. It's part of our Constitution yep. that states we have the freedom of protest. But it looks like the police are moving in in real force and do have the force and the capability of clearing out the trucks and the protesters. Are you resigned to that happening eventually? Uh, right now we're in negotiations. Uh, we're discussing some different contingency plans on what we'd like to do. Um, we will be doing a press conference here in a little bit. Okay. Uh, right now uh, we're just asking our drivers to just stand fast and just hold the line for a little bit. Let us get to you guys. Let us figure stuff out. Have you got any kind of deal with the Trudeau government? That is to say, you might move if they dropped the vax mandate. Any kind of deal discussion like that? Those were our demands. We will not. We will move if they drop all mandates. Absolutely, that was given right at the very start. But with our government right now, uh, we're second-class citizens compared to the Liberal government. So they don't even want to discuss anything with us. They don't care. They're running this country like uh, like communism and. Well, in communism, you don't have a voice. Now, American truckers are organizing convoys due to arrive in Washington, D.C. on March the 6th. Do you have any advice for the American truckers? Stand your ground. Hold your line. Do this peacefully. Do it nice. Do it professionally. We are professional drivers. We know what we're doing. And let's, uh, let's do this properly without any violence or anything that happens to any of the citizens. Let's do this appropriately. Did you keep the support of the Canadian people? We always have the support of the Canadian people. The Canadian people have spoken very loud and as well as the world has spoken very clearly of how they feel about what we're doing up here. Patrick King, thanks very much for jumping on the show with us this morning, right at the time when they are trying to clear the folks out of Ottawa. We appreciate you being here, sir. Thank you very much. Patrick King. Okay. Thank you.